A local restaurant is still in operation after settling a civil suit with the Idaho Department of Labor. Mackenzie River Pizza in Idaho Falls has agreed to pay a total amount of $319,000 after violating labor laws. Local News 8 looked into the situation and what the Department of Labor inspection process looks like. Mackenzie River Pizza is a restaurant that offers flatbreads, salads, burgers, and signature pizzas. There are three locations in Idaho. An investigation into the Idaho Falls location began after a complaint was filed with the U.S. Department of Labor. Each case is reviewed by a labor investigator who then visits the site in question, meets with the employer, and conducts confidential employee interviews. They're looking at the employer's compliance with the applicable federal labor law. Here it was the Fair Labor Standards Act, which governs the payment of minimum wage, overtime, um, and tips were also a large issue in this case. The investigation showed that Mackenzie River Pizza paid servers and bartenders less than the federal minimum wage. It failed to pay overtime rates and violated federal child labor laws by allowing workers ages 14 and 15 to work during school hours and longer than permitted by the Fair Labor Standards Act. A portion of servers and bartenders earned tips were also withheld. What I can say is that we did assess $5,000 in punitive damages um, for the employer's retaliation against a worker who uh, did confront the employer related to illegal tipping practices. In addition to this 5000 the consent judgment orders the employer to pay roughly $140,000 in tips, unpaid minimum wage, and overtime wages. The court is also ordering the payment of $34,000 in penalties. The Department of Labor works hard to ensure fair labor practice in the United States across industries. The message that I want the public to take away is that um, the Department of Labor, the Wage and Hour Division, our goal is to protect workers' rights. And we, and we do that by enforcing federal labor laws. We also serve employers by uh, getting the word out uh, notifying them of their compliance obligations and uh, working to level the playing field for employers so that everybody gets a fair opportunity to have a business in this country. Reporting in Idaho Falls, I'm Ashley Chilcutt. We are still waiting for a formal statement from Mackenzie River Pizza about the court order and what changes they are making.